It's always really sad when someone passes away. Whether it's a family member, a friend, or a beloved celebrity, we all mourn the losses of those we knew and admired. For many celebrities, we like to look back on their lives and legacies after they pass, and some of them had such long careers that they should be acknowledged. Let's talk about some of the celebrities who lived the longest as we count down the top 10 celebrities that almost made it to 100. At number 10, Prince Philip. On April 9th, 2021, the world lost the longest serving British consort in history. His Royal Highness, Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh, passed away at the age of 99. Shortly before his passing, Prince Philip was admitted to St. Bartholomew's Hospital, where he underwent cardiac treatment. Prince Philip was born the Prince of Greece and Denmark on the Greek island of Corfu in 1921, but when he was 18 months old, his family left the country due to political instability, and his uncle Constantine was forced to abdicate as the country's king. Later on, years after meeting as children in 1934, Prince Philip and Her Royal Highness Queen Elizabeth II married shortly after the end of World War II, where Prince Philip had previously served in the British Royal Navy. By 2009, Prince Philip earned the title of longest serving British consort and continued to stand by the Queen's side until his passing. Prince Philip officially retired from royal duties in 2017 at the age of 95 and once joked that he quote, couldn't imagine anything worse than reaching the age of 100. His family said that Prince Philip's sense of humor was the best part about him, so the four children, eight grandchildren, and ten great grandchildren he left behind must remember him quite fondly. He is dearly missed by many. At number 9, Cicely Tyson. After having a career that spanned over seven decades, renowned actress Cicely Tyson sadly passed away on January 28, 2021, at the age of 96. Known for her portrayal of strong black women in Hollywood, Cicely became a beloved Hollywood icon through her work as an actress, model, and author. At the beginning of 2021, Cicely published a memoir titled Just As I Am, where she shared her life story, how she became who she was, and how she was a pioneering force in shaping history. Cicely started her public career as a model, later moving on to performing arts on Broadway where she acted alongside James Earl Jones and Louis Gossett. In the 60s, Cicely launched herself into a hugely successful TV and movie career where she made a point of prioritizing roles that quote, showed the full lived experiences of black Americans. Tyson continued her career into the 70s where she starred in the hugely successful series Roots and later starring in modern shows like How to Get Away with Murder. Other than her impressive work in film and TV, where she earned countless awards and nominations, Cicely also became a Kennedy Center honoree and was given the Presidential Medal of Freedom by Barack Obama in 2016. Cicely has left behind an incredible legacy, making her a good role model for a lot of young black kids everywhere. Before we carry on talking about the celebrities who almost made it to 100 years old, I would like to ask you guys to leave some well wishes for the families of those on this list down in the comments. Let's send some positivity their way. At number 8, Don Rickles. Back in 2017, Toy Story fans were devastated to hear of the passing of Don Rickles. Don had a very long and successful career as a comedian. What most people remember him for is his role as the voice of Mr. Potato Head in the Toy Story films. Don had been the voice of this beloved character since the very beginning and was part of three Toy Story films before his passing at the age of 90. Don was set to take up his famous role once again in the newest installment of the Toy Story series, but he sadly passed away before the script was finished. Luckily for his fans, when the studio was ready to begin production on Toy Story 4, they actually got in contact with Don's family and asked them if they would be willing to give them permission to use old recordings of Don's voice to bring Mr. Potato Head to life one last time, to which they agreed saying, quote, he always said, keep my name alive and let them know who I am. So he would be thrilled by all of this, definitely." End quote. Toy Story 4 came out with Don's voice playing his beloved character and helping to keep his legacy alive and giving his supporters the chance to enjoy his portrayal one last time. At number 7, Regis Philbin. Longtime TV host Regis Philbin sadly passed away from a battle with heart disease at the age of 88 on July 24th, 2020. He is most widely known as the co-host of the New York City-based nationally syndicated talk show Live with Regis and Kathy Lee, starting in 1988, which became Live with Regis and Kelly in 2001. Other than his time as a talk show host, Regis also made a number of appearances in films throughout his career, appearing as himself in films like Little Nicky and Miss Congeniality 2, as well as voicing the character of Mabel in Trek the Third and Trek Forever After. Upon his passing, Regis's family shared an exclusive statement with People Magazine and said his family and friends are for Forever grateful for the time they got to spend with him for his warmth, his legendary sense of humor, his singular ability to make every day into something worth talking about. We thank his fans and admirers for their incredible support over his 60 year career and ask for privacy as we mourn his loss. At number 6, Sean Connery. Sir Sean Connery was best known for his incredible talent, especially for portraying the unforgettable and iconic James Bond. He was the first of many actors to bring the iconic character to life and starred in a total of 7 Bond films over the course of his career. His successful career in 
film spanned 70 years, and he even earned an Academy Award in 1988 for his role in The Untouchables. Sadly, the actor passed away peacefully in his sleep on October 31st, 2020, in his home in the Bahamas. The Scottish actor was surrounded by his family at the time of his passing. His talent and refinement as an actor defined an era and style in the film industry, and the unforgettable charm and charisma he portrayed on screen is something that defined his incredible career in Hollywood. Sean was an inspiration to so many performers, forging a path for so many talented people to make their way to Hollywood to try and achieve the same success as Connery. At number 5, Christopher Plummer Canadian actor Christopher Plummer had a very long and successful career in the entertainment industry. He provided entertainment in all kinds of different mediums, from film to theatre and even voice acting. Christopher first became a largely known celebrity for his role as Captain Von Trapp in The Sound of Music, and he capped off his Hollywood career by starring in the 2019 film Knives Out, this being his last performance before his passing. Christopher had performed in many different genres like dramas, musicals, and even sci-fi. One of his other best known roles was as Klingon General Chang in Star Trek The Undiscovered Country. For any gamers out there, you may know Christopher for his voice acting as the leader of the Greybeards in The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. This Academy Award winning actor brought so much fun and entertainment to so many people over the years, and his presence in pop culture was so steady it was almost like he was ingrained in the culture. Fans were devastated to learn of his passing in February of 2021 after he was injured in a fall. The actor was 91. At number 4, Ed Asner. Actor Ed Asner was a beloved actor who brought joy and entertainment to the masses. Some may have known him from his roles in productions like The Untouchables and The Mary Tyler Moore Show, and others may know him as the man who played Santa in the movie Elf, or grumpy old man Carl from the Pixar movie Up. No matter where you knew him from, you no doubt appreciated his talent. His final few productions were Doom Patrol and Cobra Kai, so he really did keep bringing us entertainment until the end. Ed passed away on August 29th, 2021 at the age of 91. At number 3, Larry King. Almost a year ago, on January 23rd, 2021, legendary TV broadcaster Larry King passed away at the age of 87. The Emmy Award winning host passed away at Cedar sinai Hospital in LA after it was revealed to the public that he had been battling COVID-19 for 10 days prior. Larry had a long and successful career that spanned over six decades, having gained notoriety by interviewing notable figures, celebrities, and leaders, from Martin Luther King Jr. to Vladimir Putin and so many others in between. His show, Larry King Live, became the longest running show on CNN, spanning from 1985 to 2010, and even after that, Larry kept working, interviewing, and listening to the stories of so many people from all sides and all walks of life, giving so many people the opportunity to speak their truth. Other than being a host, he was also something of an actor as he played himself in a couple of productions, but he also voiced the character Doris in Shrek 2. After his passing, a statement was released which celebrated his life and legacy with part of it saying, quote, For 63 years and across the platforms of radio, television, and digital media, Larry's many thousands of interviews, awards, and global acclaim stand as a testament to his unique and lasting talent as a broadcaster, end quote. Upon the news of his passing, messages of condolences came pouring in from many celebrities who ever had the chance to sit down with him, showing how respected he was and how he he will be missed. At number two, Stan Lee. Everyone knew who Stan Lee was. He was a comic book writer, editor, actor, and producer known for his creation and involvement in so many iconic Marvel characters. He was always a storyteller as he enjoyed writing since he was a kid, and he credited the books and movies from his childhood for his great success later in life. In 1939, Lee began working for a comic book publisher which eventually evolved into the coveted Marvel Comics by 1960. What made Stan's characters so unique was how his comic book heroes had more realistic and flawed qualities in comparison to rival DC Comics. Their success skyrocketed and the Marvel Empire grew into what we know it as today. Other than his part in creating these iconic characters, Lee also starred alongside many of them on a number of occasions as he held cameos in many of the Marvel movie adaptations. For fans of the MCU, Stan's appearance was one easter egg that we all looked forward to finding. Stan Lee lived an incredibly long and successful life until his death on November 12, 2018 at the age of 95. And finally, at number one, Betty White. On December 31st, 2021, iconic Hollywood actress Betty White passed away in her sleep at the age of 99, just a few weeks before for her 100th birthday. Betty was a familiar face on many shows like The Mary Tyler Moore Show, The Golden Girls, and I Love Lucy. Her career spanned many decades and she was successful in everything she was a part of. Other than her work in the entertainment industry, Betty was also known for her charity work with animals, having been an activist for many years. Though she sadly passed away shortly before her centennial birthday, Betty's family, in a statement, said that they don't think she was worried about dying because she longed to be reunited with her husband once again. In their statement, they said, quote, I don't think Betty ever feared 
in passing because she always wanted to be with her most beloved husband, Alan Ludden. She believed that she would be with him again." End quote. Before we end the video, I just want to send some love to the families of the celebrities on this list as well as give thanks to these stars for their years of bringing joy and entertainment to the masses. They will all be dearly missed. Anyways, until next time, I've been your host Bri Room. Remember to stay safe out there, make good choices, and tell someone you love them today.